Welcome to Vanguard Motor Sales. We specialize in buying and selling high quality muscle cars and classics. We get in new cars every day, so our inventory is constantly changing. If you'd like to go check out our website right now, we've got over 150 cars in stock. Hit this button up top. If you'd like to watch an About Us video, hit this button down at the bottom. Now let's go outside and check out what we've got for you today. All right, we're outside now with a 71 Torino. This baby is sweet. You're gonna love it. Shake her hood, grab her blue. I love it. Hey, if you wanna see about 100 pictures of her, go to our website at vanguardmotorsales.com. We're gonna put it up on the lift so you can check out the underside. We're gonna get the hood up so you can check out that Cleveland under the hood. We're gonna look in the interior. We're gonna show you everything that you need to see so you can make a really good decision on your muscle car investment. So come on up, let's take a look at this Torino. Check out the chrome bumper on this baby and the grill. Of course, we got the Cobra up front. This does have a 38 in the VIN, so it is a Cobra. I love the blacked out hood. Uh, we got a tiny little bit of jaggedness in the stripe hair, but it looks fantastic. The, uh, the flat black with the shaker. I love the blue on the car. The Magnum's 500s look amazing. Take a look how the door fits to the front fender. The margin looks real nice. The stainless looks good. The bodywork on the car is near flawless. This thing is straight as can be. Look how the door fits there. Look at that door jam too. These lips, this is the first place I look on every car to find out what kind of shape the car's in. This is one of the first things to go on a car. They had the latch out, so that tells me the guy that did the restoration really cared about what he was doing. They also put new rubber on the doors. Grab the key here so we can get in the trunk. This chrome right here is always a trouble spot on these cars too. This one has definitely been replaced. It's brand new. The louvers look really tough on the car. Good looking rear bumper. Of course we got the Cobra in the back. Everything's blacked out back here. Look at that trunk. Look at the paintwork in there. Is that amazing? The wheel wells, again, that was one of the first places to go. This looks beautiful. They've even got a Magnum 500 as a spare with a jack. Paintwork on the bottom of the deck lid looks great. We got new rubber back here also. Now look down the side of this baby. Look how nice and straight that paintwork is. Look how the door fits to the corridor. Again, the margins look great. Look how the door fits to this front fender. Beautiful. And at Vanguard Motor Sales, we're not consignment dealers. We spend the time to check the cars out before we buy them. Then when we get them here to our shop, we run them through an inspection process that allows Tom to answer any question you may have about the systems on the car. So make sure you ask him what's going on with the car. Check out the door panel. She looks great. Of course, we got a Cobra there. Armrest is in great shape. Beautiful carpet in the car. Great looking seats. Great looking dash. We got seat belts front and rear. Headliners in great shape. Even the dome lights working up there. And check out the dash pad. She looks like she's brand new. Now that you've had a quick look at the car, we'd like to give you a chance to go right to our website. You can click the button right up to your left here to do that. If you'd like to subscribe to our YouTube channel, click the subscribe button and you can check out a bunch of hot rod videos. Now let's get back and check this car out. Let's take this Cobra for a ride. One of my favorite cars. 
you guys that watch the videos every now and then probably already know I had a 67 Cougar in high school. My uncle had one of these and I loved his car. <laughs> I tell you, I lusted after his car. That car was so sweet. It was red, other than that, it was just like this. And I just absolutely loved it. Uh, this car is so cool, so fun to drive. Now down here on the dash, we got the speedo working. Looks like the fuel gauge is working. The temp gauge, I hear the uh, blower blowing. Windshield wipers are wiping. The uh, bread guy here is wanting me to go so he can watch us go by. And that Cleveland is definitely putting out some power. You can just feel the power. You mash the accelerator, it sets you right back in the seat. The uh, C6 in this baby is working awesome. Um, it's just got the AM radio in it. I don't even hear any static coming out of that. Horn's working. Now at Vanguard, we can ship this baby anywhere in the world. You just give us a call at 248-974-9513. Tom and Demo answer the phones seven days a week and practically 24 hours a day. If you do get their message, leave them a message. They'll call you back, guaranteed. Uh, we get to go for a little ride here again. You can hear the four barrels kicking in. I love it. I love the shaker out there on the hood, too. That's so cool. You mash the accelerator. The front end comes up off the ground on this baby. I love it. The shaker is just so much fun, too. That really is a cool option on this car. Now, our shop's right outside the Motor City in Plymouth, Michigan. We actually have two locations now, so make sure you call Tom or Demo and let them know you're coming. If you want to come down and check this car out or one of the other 160 we've got, so we can make sure we've got it here at our main location at 15100 Keel Street in Plymouth, Michigan. Now stick around because we're going to put this baby up on the lift so you can check out the underside. And of course, we're going to pop the hood and show off that 351 Cleveland making all that power up front. All right, we're underneath this 71 Torino now. As you can see, this baby is nice and clean underneath. Uh, the exhaust system's in good shape. These tailpipes look great. The drop downs here look fantastic. The trunk floor looks great. The frame looks great. Beautiful car underneath. Now, this baby's got an 8 inch rear end in it. Uh, did a bunch of checking. Torino's did come with 8 inch rear ends. Um, we got a 3.0 gear here. Uh, the guys rolled it over to count it, so that's an uh, educated guess, but she's right around 3.0 gear. Um, and it is an open rear end, it's not posy. Got some brand new shocks on it. Got some nice hangers there for the exhaust. Looks like the uh, flex line here to the brakes has been replaced and the brake lines. Um, one of the things we do here at Vanguard is we'll pull the brakes completely apart. We check wheel cylinders, we check installation of the springs. We make sure all that's good and tight for you. Now the hard line for the brakes are as new going from front to rear. Now this frame, take a look at this baby. This looks all original and it is super duper clean. Uh, this car probably never had to go to work every day. This thing probably lived in somebody's garage. Now, looking at the floorboards here, I see what looks like original primer here from the factory. The frame, oh, this actually isn't the frame. This is actually uh, a support for the floor. The frame's up here, a uh, unibody car. Uh, my rockers here are beautiful. Looks like they've put a new fuel filter on it. Everything looks nice and tight here. It uh, looks like there was one tiny little patch welded in the floor over here. Um, it's about that wide and about that long. Other than that, all the floors look original in the car. I don't see any evidence that anything was replaced. Now the front end here looks like it's got a newer slave cylinder, or at least a new boot. I get, maybe that's just a new boot with new uh, bushings there. Uh, slave center 
probably is original to the car. The lines look good. Um, I see some new hardware here. It looks like we probably had a uh, little bit of steering gear put on it when they did this whole front end setup. Take a look at this. New lower control arms, new upper control arms, of course, new uh, ball joints, um, calipers. The spindles look like they're new. Sway bars look great. Radius arms are in great shape. Um, nice and clean on the bottom side of this numbers matching 351 and numbers matching trans on the car. The frame up here looks great. I'll tell you what, this is one beautiful car underneath. Let's check the wheels and tires. All right, I love these wheels. Looks like brand new Magnums on this baby with the grabber blue. This car looks awesome. We've got BFGs up front. They look like they're fairly new. Um, and we've got two 35-60-15s. Now let's check the rear. And out back here, we got the same size tires, same good looking rims. I tell you what, this car is hot. Let's lower it down and take a look at the 351 Cleveland under the hood. All right, this is where all the business gets done. Underneath that shaker right there in this blacked out hood with the grabber blue. I love it. Look at that. Looks just like it came out of the factory. I tell you, you can pull into any car show and be a proud papa to pop the hood of this baby. You got a shaker. You got a 351 Cleveland. Everything is restored almost exactly like it was from the factory. They even painted the power steering pumps were uh, painted like an off blue. They got that going on. They got a brand new belt here. We got auto light hoses, auto light coil, the uh, factory appearing distributor. I mean, I've got the OK marks here. All the vacuum lines are on this uh, shaker. It looks like the... Um, all the uh, EVAP stuff for the gas tank is there still. Auto light hoses on the heater hoses, um, the solenoid, the regulator, everything on this thing is over the top. Looks just like it did from the factory. Got beautiful paint on the bottom side of the hood. Um, the car does have power brakes. Look at that, the windshield wiper motor looks like it was restored. You know, if somebody spent the time to restore the windshield wiper motor, you know, they were really cared about the authenticity of this car. And she is beautiful. Let's see what kind of carbs underneath there. I haven't had this shaker off. Yep, it looks like it's got a uh, factory appearing carburetor on it too. So give us a call at 248-974. 9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales put this shaker in your driveway. All right, we've made it really easy for you. Click on any one of these five pictures here and it'll take you right to whatever you're interested in. We're gonna give you about 30 seconds here to click these pictures. If you need more time, just go back in the video and click that picture.